Frog Leap Studios. Well, hi folks. I'm gonna show how to play the Adele Hello Metal cover that I did a month or two ago. And uh, if you want to figure out the solo that Pete Cottrell, the awesome Pete Cottrell did, you can go to his channel because he has just put out a video on how to play that solo. Links are here or in the video description, so please check this video out and then go to his video and you can learn the whole song. First off, I'm using a 7 string on this song and it's tuned in drop A, so it's A, E, A and D. And I'm only using the top four strings and it's an easy song. So please join in. So the song starts off with a piano bit and then it goes to a kind of picking style uh, lick that's uh, going like this. So we're starting on the eighth fret on the top string and just holding a fing finger like this. And muting with this hand. And that's the first chord, and the second is on the second string, on number four. And then next string on number six. And then the next string on number eight. So it's this chord. And you're muting it like this. And then you go to the top string again on number six. And then and number six on the next and then number eight on the third string so it's and muting and the last chord is on the second string on number four and uh, next string on number four and the fourth string on number six so the chord is and muting so the whole thing together is so that's the whole verse except for the end where it goes to the straight chords just a finger on number eight six uh, three and four. So it's and the last bit is six, uh, eight. I mean six and four. So it's so the whole end there is. Then it jumps into the chorus, hello from the outside. And this is also on the eighth. So same chord, except you add on the third string, you add your pinky or your ring finger on the number 10. So I'm using this for kind of a more melodic chord in my head. So this is the first chord and the second chord is on the fourth, doing the same. Just adding this. And then you go to the second string on number four and then number six on the next string. And the last chord is on number six here. And here you don't add on this, but you add on this one, so you're going from uh, uh, you're going on number six, six on the next string, and on the third string you're going to ten. So the whole chorus is.
and that's the whole chorus. And uh, basically the whole song, because the second verse is also these same chords, just you're playing them, just muting and letting go of the muting. So that's it's also on uh, on number eight and number four and this on number four on the second string and six and number six on the top string so it's the second verse is Then it goes back to the bridge thing, which I showed earlier, earlier, which is... And the chorus again. And then there's the breakdown middle stuff where it's all me and this is starting on number eight and you're doing a slide you're hitting number eight and going and then you're going two three four and number one on the second string and three so it's and on the second turnaround it's going high on number eight and seven on the second string so it's It's not too hard to play here, but this riff is all in this part here and getting the rhythm right and muting right and getting it precise on the beat. It's a simple riff, but you have to have have the beat to get this right. <laughs> And that's the whole song. Pete is taken over with his solo around this riff. So go and check his video. And then it's just back to the chorus again and finish, finishing off with a little piano bit. So knock yourself out. And I wanna see some videos of you guys doing it. It's awesome when you send me the links to those videos. I really enjoy seeing you guys doing it. And I'll see you later. Hello, it's me I was wondering if after all these years you'd like to meet To go over everything They say time's supposed to heal, yeah But I ain't done much healing Hello, can you hear me?